So if you're anything like me, you have hundreds of plugins on your system that you barely use or never used at all. It takes so much time for your door to start up because it has to scan hundreds or thousands of plugins, as well as you're getting these annoying prompts that come up from demos that you never activated. Some of you are even probably running into the issue of old, old plugins that are still on your system that if you even open an instance of them, it crashes your door. Some of these plugins are actually causing problems internally just being on the system. And you have to decipher that and go to all the different plugin folders of the AU or the VST3 and delete them manually yourself. Well, we've made this super simple tool called Bypass. And what Bypass allows you to do is it allows you to easily just scan the plugins on your system, all the different formats as well on Windows and Mac, and allows you to easily delete them. Cut and simple. Nothing special there, um, just really easy and just makes the whole process so seamless as far as cleaning up your system. Okay, so this is the Bypass app. This is what you're greeted with as soon as you click it open. And long story short, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit scan. It's gonna give me my Bypass number. And when I say Bypass number, it's gonna let me know how many plugins I have on my system through the variety of different formats. Right now, I'm saying I have 3,741 plugins on my system. Truth be told, I probably only use about 50 plugins uh, in a given time uh, as far as my rotation. Now, what I can do is while I'm looking at this list, uh, I can sequence it by its name as far as be putting it in alphabetical order. But I can also decide for myself if I want to keep these plugins on my system. When I click here, obviously the drop down comes and I can see the VST3 version has been uh, found, the AU version has been found, and the AAX version has been uh, found. I can decide which ones I want to delete if also I want to delete the entire plugin uh, in general as far as all the formats. So for instance, we have this plugin right here. I'm gonna hit delete. I'm gonna hit delete again. It's gonna prompt me just to make sure it has the right permissions to do the job. And it's gone. And literally it's going to rescan my plugins and update the list. It's that simple. No fluff, just literally getting rid of that executable file that's in the plugin folders. That's it. Really cut and dry, nothing fancy here. And that's basically the premise of the whole thing. We didn't build it to be this fancy kind of thing. Just more or less just a simple tool for you just to clean up and make your system a lot smoother as far as um, all the things that I know you're probably dealing with like myself. Really, honestly, what it was was, you know, we would get emails all the time from people having questions about other plugins and saying, how do I get rid of this and all of these issues that they're running into with other plugins. And so I was like, dang, that'd be great if we just created a simple tool uh, for people just to remove plugins whenever they hit us up and stuff like that. And so at first it was just gonna be for our plugins or just for plugins in general if people wanted it, but we wound up saying, let's just open it up to everyone. And we made it super affordable and that's why it's super simple. It's only $5 and we really appreciate any support uh, as far as you supporting the Bypass app. Uh, it would mean so much to us and um, I really hope you enjoy it. Um, and it's like I said, it's a super simple tool, nothing fancy, nothing special here, but I think it's going to help a lot of people uh, in the long run. So you can get the Bypass app at helpmedevon.com. I hope you enjoyed that. And um, I want to know your Bypass number. Like for real, this is for Windows and Mac. Please like DM me, screenshot it, put it in a story, tag us, we'll repost it. I would love to know what your bypass number is. In the comment section below, let me know what your bypass number is. I would love to know. Um, it's your boy Devon Terrell, uh, thank you so much for supporting. And um, yeah, until next time. We'll be constantly updating this thing with cool features. We'll keep you posted. Thanks again.